Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can easily share your uh, Microsoft form with your colleagues. Uh, first, let me define what I mean by sharing. By sharing, I don't mean that they are going to get a link to the survey and fill it out. By sharing, I'm inviting my colleagues to help me put the form together, essentially to collaborate so they can also add you know, questions, uh, let's say, to the survey. So here I have this uh, vacation request form. I created it. I own it. It's under my account, right? So it's uh, essentially a form I created. Uh, but, you know, I need some assistance and I need my colleague, Mary. I want to collaborate with her so she can, uh, you know, also add some questions maybe here. All right. So uh, let's take care of that. So what you need to do is because the form is under your account, you need to invite others. In the operating corner, click three dots, collaborate or duplicate. And essentially in our case, we just share the link with others. All right. And essentially um, we you have a few choices here. Uh, in my case, right, I'm um, sharing this. Uh, essentially, I want to collaborate with Mary, who is part of my um, you know, um, organization. So I'm going to generate this particular link. I'm going to copy it. And essentially at this point, I can send this link to Mary. So let's go to Mary's screen. Mary is logged in here in another browser. So she just pastes the link and uh, she will now see the same survey. Now I'm still the owner, very important to note, I'm still the owner uh, of the form, but now Mary can provide her input and make changes. And uh, this works uh, a bit like, um, you know, co-authoring on a Word Excel documents. Uh, she will get to see my presence. You see, it actually tells her, hey, Gregory is also editing this, right? So it's kind of uh, co-authoring, um, you know, essentially people collaborating at the same time. So let's uh, have Mary make a change. So maybe we'll add one other choice, I don't know, finance, just like that, all right? And uh, let's see, let's go to my screen. So uh, it actually shows, all right, it didn't tell me precisely uh, what Mary did, all right? Uh, essentially just shows, you know, I don't know if you noticed, but it showed her, um, you know, her profile uh, over here in the upper left -hand corner indicating that uh, essentially, um, you know, the user made a change to this particular, to this particular section. Uh, and again, you know, if you notice, I see, you know, essentially Mary's uh, present here. So any changes that we, uh, you know, make uh, will pretty much be visible uh, on our screens. Let's try it again. Just want to show you uh, again, uh, Mary will make another change. I'm logged in as Mary here. Let's add another choice just like that. And again, I'm going to go to screen number one and uh, right here, you see, essentially it just told me pretty quick that Mary made a change, you know, essentially to, to this particular section. Um, and that's pretty much it. Uh, essentially, again, you know, um, very important, you are still the owner, all right? You still uh, own uh, the form, it's still under your account. Uh, with this particular option, you're just inviting others uh, to collaborate, that's all, all right? So that's all I really wanted to show you in this particular video. Hopefully you learned something new. Uh, as always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.